Alright, hey guys, welcome back. I wanted to take a quick look at some other neat Ghostbusters accessories and toys that I have in my collection that aren't the typical figures or cars or playhouses. And what I have here today is a really cool uh, Ghostbusters gumball machine. So I figured it'd be fun to take a look at that and see how it works and just check it out. So as you can already see, it has some really great graphics here. You have the Ghostbusters ghost that you see on the firehouse sign uh, with the, you know, no ghost, uh, we ain't afraid of no ghosts cross out symbol across this chest. And the, uh, the ghost is really done well. It's very three dimensional. It's uh, like a bendy rubber. And the paint is really done well face and everything. It's, it's, it's a really cool, nice feature. It's very soft and pliable um, and just, just looks great. Uh, down at the bottom here, of course, you have the little spout where the gumball comes out. Uh, it's in a really nice solid blue color, which looks really good. And you have like another two-tone teal blue color as well. This is the uh, mechanism for putting the coin in and then releasing the gumball. Now unfortunately this isn't a bank, which I originally thought it was. It just kind of uh, spits the coin out after you get the gumball out. So I didn't realize this wasn't a bank actually at first. And we can take a look here at the information on the back. And this is of course 1984 Columbia Pictures Industries and all the other copyright information. So this thing is like, I think like about 35 years old uh, and in pretty good condition aside from some yellowing on the, uh, the rubberized plastic inside. So yeah, that's, that's the whole outside of the machine. And on the inside, this underneath, is where all the little uh, mechanisms and everything works. You just kind of flip this to the side, and this is where you fill it up with the gumballs, and the coin is returned out this little slot of the uh, bottom of the base. So we'll just take this, and uh, I got some here, and we'll fill this up. So there we go, we'll just put a couple in. And you just put them in like that. I don't have any gumballs, so these are white marbles, but they look identical, so no real difference there. All right, and let them settle in there. And so what you do, which is simple enough, not like this is very complicated, you can see the looks like gum right in the right inside. Looks really cool. Um, I had a bunch of these banks growing up as a kid. And uh, I usually got them for Easter or things like that, different, they would just be regular gumball. Uh, some of them were coin banks or other like theme or like uh, toy related like He-Man or Transformers and stuff like that. So what you do here is you just take the little lever and you push it all the way back and then just take a coin, hard earned allowance and say, oh god, I'm hungry, I ain't afraid of no gum. We just pull this lever forward and then it'll set into place and oh, a little stuck there. There we go. And there's your gumball. But of course I'm not going to eat that or I will be in some considerable pain. <laughs> but just to show you guys one more time how it works. Really neat little gadget. We'll just reset that back here. And you put it in like that, coin goes in, and move it forward. And there we go, that's a better little pop out there, and there it is. All ready for your bubblegum chewing needs. And like I said, both of the pennies, they pop out right down to the bottom. So you get your, get your money back, you get an instant refund. And there you go, we'll do it one more time, a little front view this time. And there you go, put it in, turn the lever, there we go, you hear it sit in place. And ta-da, got some ghost-colored bubble gum. 
Well, all right, guys. Hope you enjoyed taking a look at this small uh, review of the Ghostbusters bubblegum machine. I think it's really cool. It's very colorful. It's a really neat toy. And if I'd have had this growing up, I would have had a lot of fun with this. So I hope you guys enjoyed taking a look at this with me today. And I will see you guys back here next week. Take care. Hey guys, if you liked the video that you just watched, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, and you can follow me at Facebook at King of Retro or Twitter at hashtag 8 Brian. See you next time!